Hi everyone, welcome to the Lotus Goddess Divine Love. Oh, I forgot to sing it today. <laughs> I was so excited to read for all of you and I forgot to sing. Okay, let's sing together. Welcome to the Lotus Goddess Divine Love. Hi everyone, how's everyone doing today? Hope everyone's doing well and staying safe. Welcome to everyone and welcome if you're new to my channel. Um, I am a charm reader. I do charm readings for the Twin Flame Collective and I am a very intuitive Divine Feminine. And yeah, I'm just here to share with all of you. So thank you for joining and let's see what messages comes through. Oh, I think I should pull out a jumbo charm first. Okay, so I have this bag here with big charms. And let's see what energy comes to. And thank you for those who joined the membership. I have a new um, upcoming video coming very soon this week for um, Divine Feminines. So it's, it's a special Divine Feminine reading for the membership. If you'd like to join, you can have a look at the readings there. Ooh, look at this. Isn't this beautiful? Last time I pulled out the uh, Divine Masculine Swan. This is the Divine Feminine Swan. See, swans are in it for life, aren't they? So we'll put this beautiful swan here. And let's see what messages come through today. I am so hungry right now. I was thinking, should I grab a quick snack or should I have a snack later? But then I was so anxious to read for all of you. So if you hear my tummy growl, don't mind me. <laughs> What's the message is coming through here? It's showing here that um, the Divine Masculine is trying to balance out something in his life at this time. It looks like that he's making some decisions, very wise decisions. It's something that he's really thinking about. I feel like he um, may be in a quiet place, really. Um, he's like, now I need to face it. It's kind of like I feel he was avoiding avoiding um, something that is he knows that is going to be difficult or tricky in some sort of way um, a little bit of a challenge for him so he's like okay no more waiting I need to I need to think about it I feel like he was just um, avoiding something for quite some time and now he's like I think it's time for me to to face it whatever it is so he's He's trying to make a decision about um, about how to how to act, how to take action, how to take the first step. Um, he's feeling a little bit tied down with something at this time, um, but he is still focused on making some sort of change. Uh, I see something having to do with the old. Um, this Divine Masculine is tired of routine. He's tired of being sad. He's tired of being unhappy, unsatisfied with things not working out. He's tired of um, very negative um, connections like relationships. It, it doesn't necessarily have to be only romantic, but any type. Like I feel this is a Divine Masculine who may have been deceived even by um, somebody who he thought was a close friend or a close family member. He is tired of um, 
just just not getting what he feels um that he is giving to others like i feel like this divine masculine is trying to put a lot of effort into um things in his life and he didn't get the same like feedback or um response it's just things were not aligned here it's showing that no matter what he did if i feel like this divine masculine did a lot of things his life always never um he never prospered or he never excelled he never um was able to move forward because of all the effort he put into others around him and he did not receive the same in return he's like my life always gets flipped upside down my life always gets shaken up and he's tired of that he's tired of same old like same old same old he's starting to see that his actions it's kind of like if the divine is trying to show divine masculine a lesson a, an important lesson to be learned and he's avoiding that lesson the divine is going to reintroduce him to that lesson in different ways if he didn't learn that lesson through one person another person will be introduced into his life until he learns the lesson it will repeat the cycle so this divine masculine he's recognized that the decisions he made the things he avoided brought about similar situations similar routines similar outcomes and he's tired of that he doesn't he wants to break the karmic this is a breaking the karmic cycle this has to do with breaking a karmic cycle he wants to break it he's tired of it and the divine is really pushing this divine masculine to see what he needs to see to feel the emotions that he needs to feel that's going to make him restless that's going to make him push through push out of this there's a lot of heaviness here there's a lot of uh things that um really drag this divine masculine down it it dragged his um i feel like it dragged his self esteem he he had a low self esteem a uh, lack of confidence it pulled this divine masculine down this was a divine masculine who at one time was very um very focused on self was confident in himself or herself take as it resonates but this this experience these experiences these um individuals who he encountered during this part of his journey really dragged this divine masculine down um lack of self self-worth lack of um motivation i feel it made him um it was draining he could not see once he was in that energy he could not see the possibilities of something brand new he could not see that life can get better that life that there is a better life for for him or her because he was consumed in that that energy it's like being in the fog it was foggy he could not see and because of that what Another thing I see here that's interesting is that he was drawn to some things that he thought um were um kind of like he he was drawn to things that he thought he would get success from. He he was drawn towards things that he thought he would get his blessings from, but it was an illusion. This is a different kind of illusion. It's like he he had high hopes for um certain paths, certain people directions thinking that it will lead him to success in some sort of way but it just brought him into i feel like it it added more stress into this divine masculine's life he it caused a mess this divine masculine he he wants to turn his back on on um 
some sort of connection that has to do with karmic karmic ties. Um, there's a lot of things having to do with lack of strength to continue to move into into something that doesn't work out. He has no energy to continue to to live in that type of environment or with that type of surroundings or in that type of energy. He He's had enough. This Divine Masculine's had enough. He doesn't have the strength to keep giving his energy into this, this low vibrational energy. He has no strength to continue to move on this karmic cycle. He just wants out. It was a very difficult um, journey for this divine masculine. He was stuck, but it looks like he, it looks like somebody helped this divine masculine free out of this, um, this situation, some sort of way. It helped wake him up. It helped wake him up and see that he does not belong in this energy, in this type of environment. He's starting to see that there's other possibilities out there for him. This is, in this reading, it's more about this Divine Masculine starting to see that there is something more, more to life than, than sadness, than giving to those who do not, um, do not want to share um, in happiness or do not want to have a loving, fulfilling life. He, it has a lot to do with um, greed. Others wanting um, from Divine Masculine. It has to do with um, attachments and high expectations. He had a lot of high expectations and he didn't receive much in return. Whether it be from, a, from, from an individual or from a situation or from some sort of path that he thought he was going into um, that would lead him to his destination. If he had a goal in mind, he went down a specific path thinking that he would be able to achieve, but he didn't receive anything. He came back empty-handed. This is a divine masculine who's starting to see that a lot of the choices, decisions he made did affect his, his inner world and outer world. And what, what you feel on the inside is going to reflect on your outer world. So he's starting to, he wants to make that shift. He wants to make that positive change. And it looks like in this reading that this Divine Masculine is, is tired. It's not about purging. I don't see that there's purging here. It just looks like he's drained. This is a Divine Masculine who's just... He needs to kind of like take a deep breath, gain his strength back so he can start anew, so he can move forward. It's kind of like, say, for example, it's kind of like, say, if Divine Maskin got lost his job, right? The shock of losing that job, it's for him to, to gain the strength that he needs so he can move forward, so he can have the strength to find something new, find a new path. Maybe he wants to, um, you know, change, change locations or, you know, try something new. So same thing with this. The shock of this not working out, this kind of lifestyle is not meant for him. Maybe it's time to pack my things and start anew. It's kind of like he wants to promote himself. He couldn't find the promotion, so he's starting to promote himself. So this is the reading for today. I hope you like this reading. If you like my readings, please subscribe to my channel. If you subscribe, you get to hear more about the Twin Flame journey and about Divine Masculine, Divine Feminine. And thank you all for watching. Have a great day. Bye, everyone.